Thanks for joining us on the Road to the Moon. Getting to the moon is gonna take some heavy lifting, and the engine that will take us there is the RS-25. And not just one, but four of them. Let's get into it. So, Chris, the RS-25, tell me what's new. Let me tell you, Michael, from the Space Shuttle main engine to where we are today in RS-25, there's been a lot of process improvements and redesigns, make changes to our power hits and nozzles, as well as many other components for improvement. Our ECU, for example, has allowed us to now have a new electronic control for in-flight changes to mixture ratios, as well as thrust levels to have 100% mission success for the Artemis program. Additionally, our 3D printed components have enabled us to reduce the overall count in weld joints, brace joints, as well as many other features that as a whole, the program, we have had a reduction of over 30% in cost. We are now in full production swing, which has allowed us to make engines to support Artemis missions number five, six, and subsequent. It's gonna be a great time for us. Today, the RS-25 has been reimagined, utilizing the most advanced engineering and manufacturing technologies in the history of space travel, increasing its thrust from 491,000 pounds to 512,000. That's a total of over 23,000 horsepower from each engine. So keep your rockets fueled and your dreams soaring, and I'll see you next time on the Road to the Moon.